You know, the Olympics are already rather challenging to host this year, and the weather could be another challenge that Tokyo will have to face, not because of this storm system, a typhoon impacting southern Japan, but another one that is potentially developing well towards the south of Tokyo. So there's that storm I just showed you. That is Typhoon Infa uh, impacting Ishigaki over towards Miyakojima. But south of the Ogurasara Islands, there is Invest 90W out here. It's not part of that model monsoon flow but within that just look at all of that convection and it does look like a lot of the guidance continue to hint at uh, as something developing potentially a tropical depression or a tropical storm with that monsoon flow as we go ahead into the weekend through early next week some of the guidance even pulls it back there towards west towards tokyo now this is still in the initial phase of course so it's one of those times where you're gonna have to watch it but I'm sure for organizers out here, especially the forecasters there in Tokyo with the Japan Meteorological Agency, they are keeping a very, very close eye on it. You can see the GFS model, that is the American model, showing this pulling towards the north and then eventually hooking back towards the west as it starts to get pulled in from some of that upper level influence there over northern Japan. But at the very least, this doesn't show a direct impact of a typhoon with most of the guidance, but it does show an increase in showers at the very least with gusty conditions along the coast from Monday into Tuesday could impact some of those water events, including surfing, which it's the uh, first time surfing is going to be in the Olympics. This is what I call the SpaghettiOs. Kind of shows you different ensemble members, all indicating that there is potentially something developing. By the way, all these circles over here, that is our storm system, which will be making landfall into eastern China as we go ahead into uh, early next week as well. So just a quick update on this storm. I know um, it's still very early. Overall background flow does indicate that this is going to pull towards the north and eventually could hook back there towards the west as well, impacting at very least northern Japan. Very early. Continue checking with the Japan Meteorological Agency. I will have more updates on this as new model guidance comes in, but I did want to make a quick uh, video to discuss it. So, you know, people kind of have uh, an early heads up of what to expect. We could be seeing those increase in showers early next week for Honshu and including Tokyo during the Olympic Games.